Hi guys. Welcome to Validity. You survived reliability. And again, without reliability, there is no validity. Now in terms of this being the fireside chat, there's something you need to know. I've moved. And guess what this house has? It's a real fireplace. I mean, the honest to goodness set a fire in it. Fireplace. So maybe next time for the next fireside chat, I'll actually set a fire in the fireplace as opposed to setting a fire in the house where if the flue isn't quite clean, could be the same thing. Um, so validity, reliability's best friend, is ensuring that we are measuring what we mean to measure. If we have an instrument, for example, where we are attempting to measure levels of depression, then we need to be clear that that is what we're measuring as opposed to, say, anxiety or maybe even levels of bipolar. We need to be very clear that our content is valid, that we're asking the right questions, not including questions that really don't pertain to the topic and ensuring that we're not missing anything vital to the topic so our content is valid making sure that we have construct validity if we're measuring a construct like say proficiency in a topic that we have it tightly defined and that we have meaningful ways to measure those variables in order to measure ostensibly the construct. So let's get going on validity.